Good Friday. All right. Thank you for joining me. Um, I just wanted to put together just a short stream today. Dad, random with you guys today on a Friday. Hope you, hopefully you guys are having a great Friday. I am. I'm back to work. And Fridays are now special again, meaning that it's kind of the end of my work week and I can uh, get on a live stream with you guys. Um, I just wanted to quickly show you a couple of things, just talk about something, the, the screen debate. And I don't, I think that, I think obviously, um, if you look at the, the issue, a lot of people don't take it into consideration, you know, when they, um, when they bought the DJRC <laughs> because, um, because they're used to looking through their phone screen and your phone screen is going to be much brighter and it's a it's a it's a it's a more expensive uh, a more expensive screen some of you guys have OLED screens which is even another level better and that's that's kind of where we need to go and uh, the I guess if you could say if we could put the perfect controller together it would have a big OLED screen and the 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 the, the fact is is to get a better image in the sunlight, you need to fight back. The screen needs to fight back. It needs to have a more bright, uh, a more powerful uh, 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 transmission of the screen's uh, contents or whatever you're basically. So anyway, that's that's kind of in, in my argument was with the with the vid, with the video I did was just get a bigger screen. You know, there's a lot more less. It, probably one of the more less expensive ways to go is you can get the range that you want with a you know with a good with the with the standard controller and just get a nice big tablet you know and you know and you can still have your compact you know your compactness of your of your system you can put your you know mini tablet and everything into a small a small bag now there's a lot of solutions out there and and I, i'm actually going to share with you this is not an original idea and you guys know that and i don't claim to have an original idea um, you know, I've get, you get a lot of criticism when you put things out there um, when it comes to tech because everybody has, a, uh, everybody has a, a solution and everybody has an opinion. And mine's, mine, m what I say are my opinions. And I, had, I actually I listened to all my chat um, messages and one of the messages, you're, you're, you're just, it's just your opinion. I'm like, yeah, just like every single other reviewer and every single other influencer, they're all opinions based on what they know. It is not based necessarily always in fact, it's based on their opinion. But my opinion many times comes from my user experience. And to me, and to what I can, what I can basically help you with when it comes to this debate is user experience. Plus, um, I want to go and show you a couple of things that I found to help me make that decision, what would be best for me. And what is best for me is not necessarily best for you. To me, the better world is a larger screen, you know, the, to get the iPad or the, you know, the iPad mini, just increasing the size of the image, okay? But uh, guys, welcome in. Best regards, best regards. We got somebody, from, we got Spain in the house, thank you. Uh, uh, so thank you guys for popping in. I appreciate you, Don Cole, for popping in. Um, most of this will be is recorded, so hopefully uh, people that watch this later, um, they're going to be able to get something from it. So I've got a couple of things to show you to help you make that, you know, make a better choice. Now, this is your typical, you know, phone screen reflection, okay? This is what we deal with, and you can see that's, a, that's literally a mirror, okay? And you can see how that... That that uh, um, <laughs> my son just went to Boston and he just texted me. I'm moving to Boston. He's going to see the Red Sox play the Yankees, so I'm excited for him. He says he's moving to Boston. Oh my gosh! Um, he just can I give you a little airline story really quick? He left at seven o'clock yesterday morning. He has he just got to Boston right now, so he has been. The airlines have just been just brutal. Um, he arrived at 2:30, and then he's been now having some fun. Uh, is my is my uh, is my sound okay? I hear sometimes I hear a little bit of a a little bit of you know, it's just a real reverb coming out. Right? But okay, so what I want to show you really quick, I got a little bit of time. It's Friday. I want to show you a couple of a couple of things. Um, tablet, uh, 
his shutdown on for me, high temp, even very cold day, lost the power. The big thing with his phones, and you guys all have the same problem, right? The big thing about phones, especially with iPhones, is that the uh, that the screens are susceptible to heat and light. They they will they will dim on us, especially when it's hot. And we I, and if you hike, you understand that. Tablets don't do that. Tablets will allow you to keep that you know that. Uh, uh, change your antennas out. Um, yeah, I, I don't, guys. I, okay, first of all, I don't want to modify this controller. I here. I mean, let me just go ahead and uh, in, and uh, switch over here to my controller cam. Um, and so, so this is basically the controller as we as we see in the you know in a in a sunny day, and. It is, we are, we are getting abused at this point, and it is very difficult. Now, the solution is, and, and I'm gonna actually share with you the sites. I've actually got two sites that will walk you through the process. I'll, I'll show you two, it's pretty simple. But um, it's, it's, a, it's an anti-glare um, device of some kind. And there's, some, there's positives and negatives about this. And I'm not gonna, just gonna tell you this is the solution. A lot of people are saying, hey, this is the solution to your problem. It's not always the solution, because when you put a matte finish over the top of this beautiful screen, you are going to lose resolution, okay? So the, you, you, there's a positive and negative about everything. The only true solution is for DJI to put out a 1,000 nit screen, okay? I use my iPad 5 when flying, yeah, so do I. And I love my iPad 5, by the way. Um, I uh, actually I keep calling it an iPad 5. It's an iPad 6. I actually bought the next one, but you do not gain any resolution between the five and the six. Just so you know, and it's not a thousand nits. It's only 700, okay, or 500 actually. It's only 500. The screen on the on the DJI controller, the RC is is a is 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 700 I guess max. So so let's let me go ahead and switch over here really quick and. I'm gonna, and this so, so this is a live view of my screen now. With you can see, I, I I put on one of those matte screen protectors, okay, and it actually is pretty good. It, you know, obviously I'm playing with the light right now, but um, it does a pretty good job. And I haven't, I haven't, I'm gonna truly test this out, and. You know, you can see, I, you know, I got some little few mistakes there. You can, it doesn't have to cover the whole screen because when you, when I turn it on, you'll see. But you can see it's not perfect. You know, I got some edges, but okay. Now, where did I get this and where did it come from? Here is, here is basically, this is actually five matte screen protectors and this little screen guard kit. Actually, I put on, I used two of them already, my first one. Uh, this get basically an Amazon. Now, one of the things I want you to make sure you do when you're looking for these, these are these are plastic. These are not. These are you know these are uh, vinyl. They're not. They're not glass. You can't cut glass with the scissors. So it's important that you get the vinyl stickers. Don't make the mistake of getting. So you can tell that these are vinyl. Okay, they come with this. They don't give. You don't get the little wipes with them. Some of them come with the wipes. But you want to clean your screen really good. Just really wipe it down with an alcohol-based uh, cleaner and get it super, super clean. Okay, and then use this little uh, and that's and use this little puppy here with that stuff and make sure that you don't leave any residue on it. These are usually pretty good. Okay, now you see that uh, these are actually made for these are five and a half inch. Um, uh, screen protectors. You, you can see that there's notches in this. All you have to do is just, if you want to, you can actually pencil a straight line across that. I usually just, you know, create a, uh, a straight line like that, and I cut straight across it. Just cut out this notch, and on the other side, you want to cut off this, uh, this notch. Just go right below the, the camera hole and the, uh, the, the uh, I think that's this old speaker, right? Now that's all, and the, I don't remember the six, I think that was actually a speaker that went through there. So just cut that off and you'll put the mat side up. Um, and that's the solution. You can see how it fits on there. And you'll, you can tell that you'll have, and when you cut that off, it actually fit. You can, so you, you can actually slim it down a little bit and you can see I cut the corners off. 
I like to cut the corners off, and then you can see if the if you cut with a scissors, um, you might even if you cut with an exacto knife, the pressure will dis uh, it, it will it will it will kind of uh, kind of create a crease. So anyway, these are really cheap. These are uh, about six dollars. You get six for for six bucks. I got five of these, so that gives you a chance to make one make one mistake, and then you have a couple extras. Okay, so. Uh, you can see I, I've got three. One of them's on my one of them's on my controller. So, but this is these are screen guard. Um, but make sure you get um, uh, make sure it says that it's a plastic screen protect protector and it's not glass. Okay, glass you just can't cut, and glass is not going to help you. Glass will protect the screen, but it won't it won't um, create that matte finish. You want that. You see that? You, you can see how the light. Um, is not reflected with it, 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 it diffuses the light, which helps remove those, those sharp images. Okay, so let me go ahead and turn it on. Um, it's so you can see what it looks like. Actually, by the way, uh, this, this camera that's, re that's actually you're looking through in 1080, this is the DJI Action 2 used as a webcam. So isn't that, isn't that nice? So I've got a I've got Logitech for my for my if, if, for my regular for my regular stream, but right there, now you can see on my glasses right there. You see how my glasses are reflecting? These are not anti glare glasses. Okay, okay. So there it is, um, and you can see that there's glare in there, but it's definitely helping that problem. So let me go into my album here. I'm gonna show you, an, let me go into and show you an image. Here's an image I took the other day. This is a, a, uh, an image, this is actually video as well. But this is a, this is a 1080p image um, and of course a, a video. So you'll be able to see video actually playing in what you would see with a matte finish. And that's definitely improvement. This was definitely a sunny day. So, but, I wish I could, I wish I would have taken an image of what I was looking at as I was flying this. And you can see that you and, and you can see that the Yeah, there we go. You can tell her I'm working here. All right. So so anyway, you can see that image that matte that matte the matte uh image is uh is uh, doing a good job. So but on the other hand, I am I am I am losing some resolution here. I am losing some ability to see my image to get rid of the glare. This is not a perfect solution. So people let go and say, hey, this is a perfect solution for the glare problem. Okay. Yes, you will lose resolution. Yes. And I, I you know, if I could, you see that up close? Now, obviously this is a, this is coming from the screen, but this is the image you're going to be flying with as well. So yeah, you are losing resolution. Uh, that's it. This is a low resolution preview, of course. Okay, um, but you will lose some, so don't don't think it's it's going to be perfect. Um, I think that's that's all I got there for you guys on that on that front. So I was just I was just looking for. I was going to see if I could find another um, another example for you guys, but. There, I just I just wanted you to, to be able to see yeah, it's gonna, if I can um, let's see here storage I I was gonna yeah I, I um, Anyway, I was just looking at I was just looking at the menus, how how the menus look and everything with the matte screen on. So here I just want to I was looking at it myself, but I just wanted you guys to be able to see what you know. There's the there's the um, the open screen, and then let me go ahead and you can open. Now the one other thing about the matte screen is the the touch sensitivity is affected by it. Um, it's not too bad though. You can see that the touch sensitivity is not, is not affected um, a ton. Let me go back on there. So there's my, there's my uh, brightness control. So I just wanted you guys to see that. I wanted you to be able to see that, 
that example. And, uh, you know, and you're going to have to, you know, you're going to have to, to make, make your own, ju- you're going to have to, you know, form your own judgment about this, but it's not, there's no perfect solution for anything. Okay. So yes, it's better. Um, no, it's not perfect. So if you want to check that out, let me just give you a couple of channels that you can look, look at. I'm going to, now this, like I said, I, to get these screen protectors, I, I, you know, went to a channel, but the ones that they were, they suggested, they're no different than these. Okay. They're probably from the same factory. Um, Hey, how you doing, Susan? Appreciate it. I really, like I said, I really appreciate you guys popping in. And like I said, I like the recording of this, and hopefully this will inspire some people to, you know, to look at this problem. It's an issue that everybody's going to be dealing with, with a screen-based, with a screen-based, at least an inexpensive screen-based um, controller. Um, so let me just go to my, let me just go to my my screen capture for you guys really quick. My display display capture, turn that off. And... So the first site that I want to show you, this was the this was the guy that really uh, gave me my first. Uh, so this this was a uh, this is a uh, bleh, what's who is this here? Uh, yeah, Tones Drone Adventures. Okay, guys, I'm not I'm not claiming this is my my solution. I wanted to wa- I, my job. Remember, as a reviewer, is to walk through these things. Okay, I like this idea. I don't like it. It's an opinion, right? So I like it. Tone. Basically, I went to his I went to his site. And he gave, uh, he had a link on there, but I, you know, sometimes these links through Amazon are not good. I will give you this link um, for, I'll give you this link for these. Um, this one here is just called Screen Guard Professional. Okay, so that is the, that is the version that I, that I found. All right, I'll put that on there. I'll put the link in the description for that if you want to check that out. It's not the only solution. I'm always looking for the, the, the least expensive version of these, but I think it'll help. I think it'll be better. It's going to be better. Um, it's going to be better than this. Okay. It's going to be better than that. All right. That sucks when you're flying and that is what you're looking at. And you're seeing a, an outline of yourself. You're seeing anything that's picked up this. I mean, by seeing clouds while I'm flying, that is not, that is not helpful. Now, now the question is, are you navigating or are you in photography mode? If you're probably in full on photography mode and you're that serious, then you might want to consider maybe a a hood. I do not. I'm just going to give you my opinion. I do not like uh, controller hoods. They are cumbersome. They take up space and I do not like carrying them around. I do not want anything big to be added to this, because the whole point of this, this solution right here, the whole uh, point of, of the controller is, to, is for it to be small. I want to maintain my portability if you're a, a hiker. maintain. I don't want to carry a bunch of extra stuff, okay? I want to solve the problem, and I want to carry extra stuff. The other thing you can do, these are not expensive. Put your anti-glare on. It's not working for you. Peel it off and throw it away. Get, bring a bunch of them, pre-cut them, and put them on when you need them, okay? Um, I suggest when you put these on, I put on a lot of these on phones and things like that. Um, I, this, is, this is a couple of tricks that I, that, I, that I know about putting these, any, even the glass ones on, is as you're putting it on, bend it like this. Put the center down, and then from the center, let it, let it go out. Okay. And then clean the crap out of this. Use a liquid based cleaner. I used glass cleaner. Um, and then make sure there are no, no dust. I mean, if you got to, you know, go crazy on this thing, do it, clean it five times, take off this, the, the, the down, the downward sticky side, bend it. Here, we take it out of here again, bend it slightly, bend it like this. Okay like that, bend it like that. And then you apply it, you apply it carefully with the center of the bend down. Okay. And then you let it basically flatten out. That's, I put on a hundred phone screens. I've guys, I've fixed my kids' phones a million times. I I usually use the glass ones when I'm doing that. Now this is going to also give you a little bit of protection as well. So 
So give it a try. Guys, you're out six bucks, okay? These are six dollars. You don't have to buy them from a link that I give you either. Buy them from whatever link you want. Go on to, go on to eBay. Um, I'll, I'll give you the link for this. These work pretty good. And you can see this is, an, this is how they look when they're on. Pretty good. You don't see any bubbles. So that's really, the, you know, you see it on the edge, but who cares, okay? If you're that crazy about your screen protector, then I'm not, I'm not the man for you. But when I put on phone protectors, the glass ones, I can put them down like they are glass. So there's a lot of really good systems for that. Uh, hopefully, maybe DJI will come out with one that is a matte finish that is already cut. But right now, there aren't any. There are tons of like gorilla gorilla glass versions for glass, but there are. I did not find any online for this uh, for anti glare. Okay, but is this the perfect solution? It's way better. Okay. Oh, here, I'm going to put a light on for you guys, okay? So there is a, there is a light. Now it's getting, direct, it's getting direct light. Not bad. That's pretty good, I would say. Um, I can see the colors. You know, be, be quite honest. You can see the colors pretty good, okay? It is, you are, okay, a matte finish is going to give you that slight imperfection. And if you're kind of nutty about your, uh, your color grade or your, your color, you know, I, I would say get really familiar with your settings so you, you know, in a certain lighting condition, you don't have to worry about that. And get, you know, preset your controller for the, for the, the conditions that you're in, um, and that will be helpful too. And then when you're flying, this will help you fly. So, but anyway, I just wanted to give you guys an idea about that. Guys, if you have not uh, been, if you have not yet, please hit the like Um and, you know, I'm still going to get those comments that, you know, you know, you're an opinion. You don't, you know, you're just another guys. I, I am a, I am a fly. I am a flyer, which who uses my experience to help you. That's my, that's my channel. That's what I'm about. I'm an influencer because I want to influence you. I want to get you going a, a very good direction when it comes to flying uh, things that work really good for me, but I'm not the only opinion. Okay, let's go. Let's look at another site here. Now, this is the guy that I really, I really, um, I, I really like. I thought, I thought that, um, that, that was, uh, you know, a real good. Here, let me get that turned off. Here, let me get that turned off. Here. So this is, uh, this is, uh, um, Tones Drone. Uh, he's got a yeah. He hit a thousand subscribers. All right. So that this this guy right here. Okay. So check his stream out. Check out his solution. Go to I, I'll uh, um, I can't I can't do it right now. I can't like put this URL in there, um, but I'll I'll post it. I'll put the link in the description for Tone uh, as well. So let's go here. This is um, this is Nobby Green. Okay, Nobby Green. Uh, um, I think he's from the UK. I don't. I haven't checked his. I haven't checked his his channel information. Um, am I subscribed? Yeah, no, I'm going to make sure I do subscribe, though. There we go, Nobby. Nobby Green, I am now a subscriber for you. Did I not subscribe to Let me see if I'm subscribed to him. I think I did, yeah. I did subscribe already to, uh, to Tone's Drone. And now, because uh, I want to give these guys, this is, the, this, these guys were here before me. I, I, I didn't know they existed until I knew I had a problem. And then, like you, I went out looking for the solution to the problem. So what I want to do is bring my viewers, you guys, to their channels, and so you can see their solutions to the to these same problems. Okay, uh, he's got two thousand subscribers, so he's he's an up and comer too. Awesome. Uh, so his he says instant fix, uh, less than five minutes. He does a really nice job putting his screen protector on. He does not show you how to do it. Okay, he I, he does not give you like uh, he doesn't sh go walk through. I just I just showed you some things that should help you. Okay. Um, Slightly bend, make sure your screen is absolutely, absolutely clean. Use tons and tons. Use a, uh, an alcohol-based cleaner. Um, do a really good job at getting the stuff off. Then use a, a, a dustless um, microfiber. Get it clean. Um, these are actually paper. Let me just show you these again. I thought this was a really good, a really good solution. So these were, uh, these have this little, and you can see that that is a paper base. Here, let me turn off this glare here. 
Um, but that is a paper-based material, and it does not leave residue. It did a really good job, I and mean, you can see by what my controller looks like that it was, I did a reasonable job at cleaning it off. But uh, these are about six bucks, and they took me two days, you know, they just send them in a, a little quick little the Amazon e-package. So this was E-Tech Collection, five pack, um, ET, ET plastic screen protectors, so. So anyway, that's what I used. That was my solution right there, these screen guards. You can use whatever you find, but remember, they have to be the plastic ones, okay? You, the glass ones will not work. You're gonna try to put a glass one on, you're gonna try to cut it, you can't cut that stuff, okay? So, all right, hopefully that helped you guys. Um, but thank you so much for, uh, for joining me. Hope, hopefully this helps you with your, with your controller. Guys, I am not a curmudgeon on this controller. I love it, okay? I, 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 do, not, I do not have any issues, okay, with, with, this, uh, with this system. I love it. So don't, uh, don't get me wrong, okay? But you will get a little bit of matte effect, okay? And it is something that it's, it's not something that it's part of the problem or, or any, excuse me, it's, it's part of the things you're going to have to put up with, with this specific solution. All right. But it does help. Um, I'll fly a little bit more with it and I'll give you some more examples of real time flying, but I'm going to keep this on for a while. And if I do take this off, if I do take the matte finish off, if I do take this specific screen solution off, I'll let you know and I'll tell you why. I'll go, hey, you guys, I, you know, uh, I, I, I flew with this on for, say, three months, and I decided that it wasn't worth the hassle or, but I, I do not have any other way of protecting this screen. So I get a protection, anti-glare at the same time. But you do have to pay, okay, a little bit in resolution. Does it work? Yes. Uh, you still have a complete uh, control. Um, of, of the sliders, okay. I have, I, you know, there's a little bit of, you know, there's a little bit of uh, funkiness in there. But once again, you know, you're you're messing with the haptics of this, okay. You're messing with the touching. Um, so, all right. Um, should I do a quick uh, a quick instructional on? Hey, if you want to take a screenshot, push the screenshot button. <laughs> <laughs> there it is. <laughs> Guys, there's actually a video out on that. So um, I just uh, I just redid it. You want to you want to record your screen? Push the freaking record, record screen button right there. Click on it. Bang, you're going. There it is. Now it's counting down. Anyway, guys, that's not what I meant to do today. But that's it. Hit stop and you're done. And then now I've got a recording, don't I? Okay. But I've recorded my recording. So that shouldn't be a very good version of that. But anyway, <laughs> uh, do I have a do you I have an email uh, an email for contact for me? Yes, I do. Um, my email is uh, is uh, here. I don't. Uh, gosh, I used to have it. Uh, I used to I used to be able to put it up in my uh, in my thirds. Um, yeah, here. Let me just here. Let me just type it in. I'll put it up here. Just give me a second. Um, let me do a little bit of a uh, little bit of. Uh, a couple of administrative things. I've got another computer running here, which I'll go ahead and I'll put those things in for you. But uh, let me just go ahead and and punch in my email. Um, it just so you have a a a quick a quick. So it's at uh, dad. Uh, dot random seven zero at g mail.com so there it is whoops I what I put at there I'm used to doing my so it's so there it is uh, I just threw my email up there it's dad.random70 at gmail.com um, there is I think uh, I think in my in nightbot it does put some of that stuff up there yeah it, it puts up other things uh, there's my Twitter is up there um, on with the nightbot and that kind of stuff um, let me see if I can here, let me find these two uh, web links for you too. Let me put up, I'm gonna put up um, Nobby Green and I'll put up uh, for you guys. I got, I got time here. So I'm gonna go DJRC controller glare and I'll let me post these for you guys as well. Um, there's, a, there's other people out there, 
But this guy here, um, this guy here does a nice clean job, just giving you an I the idea. There's not a lot of details in it though, so uh, you're gonna have to. So let me go and find that there. And let me find. Let's see. Let me let me take his URL. Um, copy. I suggest the other one first. So let me go here. Um, hey, let me see. Let me get that on there. Oh, I am I am just slow today. But this is this is this one right there. So that one is the one I just put up there is Nobby Green, and this other one. Uh, which is Tone's Drone Adventures. Okay, so I'm guessing his name is Tony. Um, this guy had, I think, probably the better of the two um, tutorials. So let me just put him up there too for you guys really quick. And uh, let's see here. This is Tone again. And Tone's Drone Adventures. And let me just put, uh, let's see, I'll share his link with you guys. So this is Tone. And, you know, and check those out. So like I said, I, I don't, I, anytime I can give, anytime I can give um, and reference somebody's site, uh, basically credit, it's not my idea. But I had to experiment with the idea and I wanted to share with you guys how, you know, the results of it. And that's what today's stream was about. Uh, let's see, I, I'm new, got the Mini SE though. Uh, Don Cole, um, the Mini SE is amazing. And, and, and the cool thing about the SE, I am a huge fan of the SE. And the reason why I'm a fan of it is it's inexpensive and it is really capable. And, you know, the cool thing about the SE is that it also uses both batteries. So, Don, you can use both the lithium-ion batteries and the original Mini 1 batteries, um, or the, excuse me, and the Mini 2 batteries in that. You can use both uh, batteries. So, if you look, I suggest you go do the lithium-ions. Um, uh, guys, the lithium-ion batteries store better they are not as they're not susceptible to heat you won't burn your car down um there's a lot of advantages to the lions so and the last they have a lot more charge cycles in them now you don't get as much of you don't get as much punch power with uh, that you get with the uh with the uh with the new with the uh with the mini two batteries so with the se the best at the best of both worlds. You get both. You get both battery systems that work with it, and you can you can get a multi charger that'll charge them both at the same time. So I love the SE. You can get then get the then get the Yagi's. The Yagi's are really cheap. I think you find the Yagi antennas for like under ten bucks now. Uh, and put that on your on on your antennas, and that'll really help your range. Do not get the clamshells. I mean, if you're a fan of the clamshells, you know the clamshell antennas, the ones that are you know that are shaped like a like the like a half of a clamshell, and they're reflective inside. They reflect the signal forward, but they don't allow signal as much signal to go behind you. So if you're flying in an area and you want to fly around, and you get to the side of you, um, the Yagi's are better. So um, that's why I like that. So anyway, thank you, Susan. I really appreciate the, the, the positive comments. Guys, it is Friday. Um, we have been here now for 35 minutes. I wanted to control the length of my Friday streams. I, I, guys, we will have some fun on Fridays too. It's not always going to be informative, but this one I wanted to bring to you today. So guys, thank you so much for popping in. Um, this is something that will be helpful. And like I said, there are some great places you can go. Uh, and of, uh, and of course, um, not e this is not a solution for everybody. If you're a photographer, you might get not like this, you know? So yeah, it's an opinion. Guys, what I say is an opinion, but most of the time it's opinion on experience, okay? From experience. Um, most of us can't BS our way without having some kind of background. So uh, uh, hey, thank you, yeah, thank you. I appreciate you. Like I said, Don, I really appreciate it. So all you guys that have popped in, um, great. I uh, don't forget on on Tuesdays. Now we haven't been doing it regularly. Remember, uh, I uh, I like to get on with uh, with with Lone Star UAV. Um, we uh, we we work as a team. 
Uh, I'm, I, I, my, my intentions are to get him back onto my stream. It, he's busy right now. He's a busy guy, um, and it's too hard to try to coordinate two different streams all the time. So I like to get on his stream and to, and to, and to, uh, to push his uh, stream forward. Um, he is a very smart uh, uh, user, uh, F, he's a he's a he's a really intelligent FPV, uh, uh, knowledgeable flyer. Um, I, I where I kind of be the G, I'm the GPS guy. He's definitely the FPV king, uh, and that's why I really appreciate him when he uh, uh, runs a stream and he can you know, he drives it forward um, with uh, with his expertise. So, alrighty. So for Dad Random, all right, guys, glare. Uh, Glare, glare, glare. Um, can we fix it? Yeah, we can make it better. We can't make it perfect. It's not going to be a perfect world, um, but we can definitely, we can definitely make things just a little bit uh, more. Uh, you know that sucks. Okay, you know that sucks, right? And we can make it better um, by, you know, some simple fixes. Okay, and. You know, it does work. It does make a it does make a difference. But it does, you know, once again, it does take away. Where is Kai? Where is Kai? Uh, no, Kai. Kai's probably still working. It's one forty. He probably got yeah. You know, Kai's got a. Kai's got a. He's he's busy now. He's got a new. He's in a new. He's been. You know, he's not in a new relationship, but uh, he just moved in with the with the with this uh, with the significant other. So. Uh, and they, uh, they've got a, a house and they've got a lot of things and he's helping uh, to put this house together and uh, he's busy at work and he's gone through a bunch of things with his heart. So he's trying to catch up, but we're, we're trying to get on once a month. So we, Kai and I, uh, are, will be on at least once a month. I, I will, like I said, once I get my live stream thing figured out, um, which I've been trying to do forever here. Uh, we'll get on together, and I'll invite him in as much as I can. But he's he's going to be too busy for me, is what's happening. So, all right. So for Dad Random, uh, I am going to clear out of. Uh, we are we are out of here, and um, hope you guys have a happy Friday. Let's get some music we going. Can a bit of music here. That we feel nothing, but if you came, I am That's that's Mike sound. Yeah, anyway, thank you guys. Appreciate it. Have an awesome, awesome weekend. And I'm back. Bye.